it is 6 of 4 in the morning. I'm ridiculously sore, but we are here at the bottom of Mount Baden Powell up there. You can see Mount Baldy in the distance with some snow on it. It's the North Face. And yeah. So we are at Vincent Gap at 6,592 6, feet. We're walking up there all the way to Mount Baden Powell at 9,399 feet. Wildflowers in July. What a. It's pretty cool. So, we're pretty much at 7,800 feet right now. Because I saw the map Lamb Spring, 7,800 feet. So, I think we're about maybe like almost halfway. But it is so pretty over here. Okay, right here we got our first bit of snow, and it is still July. It is July 1st, and we have snow right here. It's a testament to how crazy our winter has been. I'm guessing we're about 8,000 feet, maybe a little more, and there's still snow. That was pretty cool. Wow, it is incredibly beautiful right here. Got some sugar pines, some Jeffrey pines. We got the desert way over there. And even better views when we get to the top. I'm going off trail a little bit here, but look at all that snow. Look at how pretty this is. It's insanely beautiful up here. Look at that. Snow, snow, and probably look at all this snow. snow. <laughs> a lot of snow over there. Wow, this view is crazy. That is one big patch of snow. Almost to the top. Yeah, a little bit of ice patches you gotta go over, but not too bad. As you can see in this particular gully, there was quite a large amount of snow. You could probably ski down that a little bit. But there are intermittent snow patches all the way up to what I assume is the summit, somewhere up there. And there we have the summit of Mount Baden-Powell, the Mojave Desert. Uh, the rest of the Angeles National Forest, including Mount Baldy, the North Face, which I showed you earlier. Beautiful. Look down to the valley and to the city of Los Angeles down there. If it was a clear day, you couldn't see the ocean. I can confirm. We got Pine Mountain right there, Mount Baldy. Uh, yeah. It's freaking beautiful up here. Look at these. In the, in the, in the winter, this is a crazy ski descent. I mean, like, People go down here, these shoots, it's crazy. <sighs> Someday. And the summit of Mount Baden Powell. Pretty much above the tree line, high alpine zone with significant snow patches. <sighs> and some high alpine shrubs. Apparently, I'm not the first one to get here, but it is still pretty cool. I haven't eaten anything this whole day. Nothing. So I'm gonna enjoy some num nums right now. <sighs> oh, that's good. That's really good. Sometimes life is sweet indeed. That right there, I believe, is Mount Islip or Islip. I don't know what it's called. Um. There's some like really old trees up there, I believe. And uh, a little bit farther. That right there might be Waterman Mountain. I could be wrong though. Um, but if it is, I, I went snowboarding there earlier this winter. And I have a video of that if you want to see it. I just hiked up and I snowboarded down. It's pretty cool. Uh, so watch that if you're interested. Yeah. Here we are above the tree line. Mount Baden Powell is the. Uh, Pillar thing. 
And we got a big old snow pile right here, right on the north side of the summit. I'm gonna walk on some snow right now. Woo! Yeah, there was some, some tough, uh, snow climbing, I guess you would say. Not really climbing, you know, but it blocked the path, so you had to climb over it. Um, but, yeah, this is really cool. I'm surprised there's so much snow. I mean, this is, this is really, really cool. It's incredibly beautiful up here. Looking up at the summit to the south. Yeah. And here we have our July snowman. Kind of a sad snowman, but a snowman nonetheless. Built in July, of course. Oh, it's so cool up here.